What's going on guys, Artificial Rest here, and today I'm very excited to actually bring you a highly requested tutorial. And it's gonna be how to show your Twitch chat in game. That's right, you heard it right. I'm going to teach you how to view your Twitch chat with only one monitor while you're in game. Which is pretty goddamn awesome. So, the first thing you want to do is go ahead and go into your browser. You would want to go ahead and search into Google and search for Trillion. Once you search for Trillion, you can go ahead and click on the first link that pops up, which is Trillion I am, and you can rather choose the download or the get Trillion. This is going to bring you to a page where you have different options. You can go ahead and download the free version because you won't need any of the pro or the lifetime stuff. So we'll just go ahead and let this download. The nice thing about Trillion is it's kind of, well, it's free, but you get a few ads here and there, but you know, nothing, nothing major actually. And it's a really nice feature to be able to see your Twitch chat in game, which means you can only stream or you can stream from only one monitor without having, you know, a different monitor just to view your Twitch chat, etc. All right, so once this is downloaded, you can go ahead and go into the file where you downloaded it and go ahead and start it. This will just run the regular, you know, installment as you would for any other any other computer program that you use. Is, you know it's fine you can go ahead and tick off or on some of the options that you want I'm not gonna add a shortcut to my desktop because as you guys know I am not a big fan of having a big messy very big messy um, desktop with a lot of icons just the, the last Photoshop project and you know a couple of games maybe as the game on the uh, desktop is right now and then when it's done click on launch and you'll have to register a new trillion account uh, if you haven't got one already of course uh, just type in your a uh, username I'm just gonna use artificial rest and as for password I'm not gonna tell you that because that is gonna be secret as always which is kind of you know regular but oh well and we can type in our email which will be blurred out for privacy purposes of course and just take that you are over 13 and understand what the hell is going on and then it will create your account so you just have to wait until it have created your trillion account when it's done just click on next you can just simply just skip all this uh, you won't need any of it for using or viewing your twitch chat so you can just skip it, skip it, click click next and finally click done and it will log you right in. You will get an email which you'll have to um, which you will have to um, confirm that that is actually you. Alright so once you have installed Trillion you want to go or you will have this kind of window here and what you want to do is go up to the bar where it says Trillion and pick the first selection down which is manage accounts this will bring you to this image or this window right here and what you want to do here is alright so this is me via Trillion uh, the Trillion network but we want to add the option to connect to the Twitch network which uses IRC so what you want to do now is go to add new account and pick IRC and the account name you can name whatever something relevant so I'm gonna call this if I can type it right artificial rest twitch all right so a nickname you want to put in or insert your actual nickname or your username on twitch which is artificial rest well that's mine but whatever your guys's name are you can choose that and server host you are going to type in irc uh, dot twitch dot tv that is your host 
You can click on that just to get some to see some other hosts but I don't think it's on there so I haven't tried that so whatever you can just do that automatic automatically connect to this account on startup you might as well click that it doesn't really matter it's fine and once you have done that you can go ahead and go into settings now you want to have a twitch password or a server password rather for the Twitch server which will be on this site right here you can go ahead and um, go into the description and this will be here so you can click on connect with Twitch and this will uh, you need to authorize it to your Twitch channel once you've authorized it you can just copy this one and go back into Trillion it's this one yep insert that and you should be good to go from here and we can go back and just to see that it inserted it correctly you can just go ahead and go back into the connection settings options and you can see that it is right there after you've done that you can click on the or check it so this way it will be connected Alright, so now that you are ready for the next step, you want to go ahead and open your Twitch page. So you can just open the chat and, you know, just to confirm that this actually, what you type in the uh, Trillion chat actually comes up in the Twitch chat. So what you want to do now is go ahead and type in. Alright, so I figured out what, what was wrong actually, so we'll try this again. So. If you don't have the chat window open you and only the sidebar, you can go ahead and go into, um, not Trillion, but over there, that little IRC, IRC window. As you can see, it looks like a little question mark from afar. I don't know what it is, but go into show status window and you'll get this. So what I did wrong last time was that I typed uh, with uh, not lowercase letters, which didn't work so if you want to connect to your twitch chat all you need to do is type your username in lowercase uh, it doesn't matter if I have artificial rest with a big A and a big R it doesn't matter because this chat window doesn't take like big letters when you are supposed to connect so once you have done that you can simply press enter and then it will connect you. So you can see I've had four tries before I've figured out what the hell was going on. And we can go ahead and minimize that and go ahead and close the Justin TV uh, window or whatever that window actually is. And now if I minimize that, we can, let's see, we can type something in the Twitch chat. Uh, if we type, hello world. You'll get a little notif notification and as you can see it started blinking down here which it will show up here so you have now successfully connected your twitch chat to your trillion account um, if I type in hello streamer it will show up here so it's pretty cool right all right so the next step is pretty crucial before we start up the game we'll go back into the trillion and or the trillion program and click this little icon right here irc and we'll go into no actually we'll just click on the trillion tab up here go into preferences down into chat windows and scroll down until you see the in-game chat it's important that this is enabled uh, i've set it to Control t or i think that is the standard shortcut actually and just for the purpose of this video I'll just keep it at control T so now you can go ahead and close this window and minimize this it's important not to close out or X out this window because this is the uh, twitch chat which is connected and if you close it it will be disconnected and it won't work in game alright so now we can start up a game click play it should launch and as you can see, access trillion while playing. A little tab, like in Skype, or not Skype, like in, um, what's it called? Steam, like in Steam. And you are connected. So if we now press Control T, 
you'll get this kind of overlay which shows the time uh, some different stuff and the Trillian logo kind of like the steam overlay when you use that shortcut in game uh, it's kind of it's kind of the one downside by using Trillian uh, like this it would be nice if you only got like this window right here the black area if you only got that on the side or something uh, you can move it but you still get the overlay uh, the overlay effect um, also the reason why it looks kind of crappy and squeezed together is because it says which chat room I'm in so you can just go ahead and click this little icon here which will straighten it out and will look much better so now if I type something in my twitch chat I'm on my other other monitor right now and I'm gonna type something in the twitch chat um, I'm gonna type hello are you in oh shit are you in game right now buddy with three D's no worries as you can see it shows up so I'm still in game I'm still in game and you can see the twitch chat how nice is that but you don't have to go into this overlay actually to view the chat uh, so if I go out of it and if I go ahead and go into my twitch chat right now and if I type something cool it shows up down here so how cool is that feature so you can easily and quickly respond to the latest message you get you can also turn off the sound if you hear that little ding playing sound all the time if someone is very active in your chat so I think that is basically it guys um, I hope you have uh, enjoyed this video it's been a while since I brought you a tutorial and it seems like this was a very highly requested tutorial actually so again I hope you guys have enjoyed this and I will talk to you guys later